Hello everybody, it's your boy Sil. We're gonna be doing standard. We're gonna go as the silent. We had a really good game with the Ironclad last time. It was pretty freaking insane. I love it. And of course we didn't make it to the first boss last time with this boy because this boy is kind of trash. This boy is kind of the worst boy. And I definitely hope the defect is better than this boy. Because I would greatly prefer a boy better than this one. Ah, oh, man. That ironclad game, though, was so mint. It was so mint. It was the mintiest. It was mint fresh. It was like, oh, by the way, would you like to be ridiculous? And I was like, yes. I would love to be a little ridiculous right now. I've been having, like, not the greatest week. Hit me up with a little ridiculous. And the game's like, baby. Baby, fam, I got you. We're gonna make you so ridiculous, you're gonna explode all over the world. Did I take Cataclysm? I did it, right? No. Let's just buy some potions. We're gonna ridiculous new all over the goddamn wall, baby. And I'm like, yes, please. This is this is what I needed. Baby, that's, that's what I wanted. And the game delivered. It was a fun round. I notice now that Neo's blessings are on a character by character basis as of course as the ironclad we made it all the way to the final boss but that doesn't matter because it wasn't with the silent this is actually turning out not terrible I'm not willing to get my hopes up over it but I can make it work I think we can make it work enough to afford riskier plays. We'll save the skill potion for next turn. I hate you so much, Silent. Every time, every time I start giving you a little bit of wiggle room, and I'm like, you know what? Maybe the silence okay. Maybe it's an alright character. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm just bad. Or maybe the game's RNG has been screwing me over. Maybe I just don't know how to build a good silent deck. Then you throw this shit at me, and I'm just like, ah, yes. No, you just fucking suck. We'll take Predator. As much as I like Choke, we're gonna take Predator. Tori's a really good relic. Alright, third elite. Dagger spray because it deals two more damage than a strike. Alright, let's go with the flying knee. Neutralize. Call it attack. And do another strike. You hit with the skull bash first there. That's that's nice. By nice, I mean just a little bit absolutely terrifying. Solid hit. Go for the pred into the all out for the win. Alright, so see, first floor, three elites dead already, a fourth on the way. Like, this, this, this character can work. It's just, I don't understand why it doesn't so often. And we got our four block from the fan, which will block the four attack from his stab. We'll take a back stab. Again, still, me, I like back stabs. There's nothing wrong with stabbing someone in the back if the goal is to survive and kill other people. Right? I mean, it's the cost of doing business, really, at that point. And a pendant was charged, and 
hopefully, because of the way this fight's going, we're going to be able to get Pendip almost fully charged for the next fight. Which will be fantastic. If we can get our Pendip on the opening turn with the next boss with a Predator. That would be pretty bent. Uh, almost. We'll take a Sucker Punch. Alright, we're at the first floor already, so we're going to be getting Neo's Blessing on the runs after this. Unless I quit over here, which I won't do. Um, okay, so that would be so. 16, it's alright. It's not as much as I'd like to deal with it. And I mean, we still had two energy, but... It's alright. We got back up to level 4 on the pendant. 62, that's where we had him um, the last time we fought him. With the Ironclad, I think. We got him to exactly that much health. Uh, when we popped him. Ten nibs, gonna be 30. That's 8. That's the way to handle that. We're not going to be able to insta-kill this one, but 2 at 13, and we're at full health still. Not bad. And we even have lethal. Alright, see? It's perfectly doable for this character to not utterly piss me off. She can do it. It's just so few and far between sometimes. It feels like I'm Feels like I'm grasping at air, cause ain't nobody here, you know? I don't really think there's... A skill here I wanted to play twice. Which is why I didn't play burst there. This'll knock all the birds down. And kill the one that was already on the ground. Ain't no thing. Kill that bird out right. We did only take one damage there thanks to the Tori gate. Tori. Take a piercing whale. Piercing whale's an extremely good card. Alright, so onload, normality. No, oh, there we go. Yeah. Only one. Hmm. Alright, let's keep going. We want to get to the shop, right? Because we're going to have, like, a decent amount of scratch by the time we get there. Ten damage is charged for next turn, which is great. If we draw a Predator right now, that'd be sick. Ah, uh, this is fine. I would have liked to have been able to get through a little bit more of the plated armor, but... Oh, well, that randomly discarded my attack card. And of course, we draw our two predators together. Instead of one after the other, which is the dream. He's a dead boy. It sucks that we wasted pen name on it. We'll take a well laid plans plus. We'll keep both of those. Those are good cards. Piercing Whale, all at attack, on load. He's gonna just heal back up though. Predator, Sucker Punch. He's gonna heal again. 
again. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Predator. Strike. We'll get rid of all of that. We want better cards. Let's go with the neutralize. Burst into the defend. And hit him up with the poison. Predator into survivor, I think. We'll save that sucker punch. We might be able to make this work. As much as I would have liked to unload there, I think we needed to save it. Give him dead for sure. But it was still an annoyingly difficult fight. Let's go. These new potions are fun. I, I legitimately think the new potions in this game are good. I think they're perfectly valid. Oh, this is gonna... This is gonna suck. Be something good? Ah, oh, you know what? I'll take it. It wasn't like the best card I could have ever gotten, but it was alright. And we do have our lizard's tail, but again, we want to save that. Like, we want that lizard's tail to pop on the final boss, if ever. I mean, the ideal situation is just to have the lizard's tail never pop, right? But, I mean, we have to be... We have to pretend to be a little realistic here. I'm just not that good. <laughs> not yet, at least. I mean, I can be. If we're playing on normal mode... I don't, I don't fucking need that shit at all. Oh, we're gonna get an extra energy next turn, thanks to the Art of War. It's gonna let me get his damage down to four. Um, that's a big hit that I can't mitigate effectively. It's not good on my face. Alright, he's, he's dead, but we got way too low off of it. Predator. I think it deflects us. As much as I like Caltrops deflect, deflect is useful, right? Anything that's just free defense is good. This boy just hits so freaking hard, man. Click that backwards again, like for the fifth time. Punch. 
Uh, punch. Alright, so we're going up against the champ with 40 health. It's probably not gonna go the best it ever could. Like, no one ever was. Catch them is my real test. Train them is my cause. My <gasps> what? Since we're not allowed to... Fuck! Why would they do that? You, you have never been able to discard potions in combat before. <sighs> and now I'm getting fucking screwed by it. Another fucking mouse, man. Just jumps all over the fucking place. Never where it's aimed. Ugh. That artifact was supposed to be like the thing, the play to help keep me alive. By mitigating his bullshit debuffs. But I threw it out! I threw it out. We still have our lizard's tail, though. because we've been weak for like the last five turns. No, he's shrink buffing. Never mind. I think I'm just dead. Yep. <laughs> Even using Every defensive option I could, there was no way to do that. Sills out. Mm, the silent could go fuck itself.